Q-Doma once again. I am trying to contemplate what I want to eat today. We are going to a most special place. It is called Cheeseburger Cheeseburger. It is most awesome. Literally. It is better than McDonald's. It is better than Burger King. It is better than Wendy's. It's better than it, Five Guys. Yeah, Five Guys. Which I call, aka, Five Gays. Yeah, Don't ask me why. It's just something. This is just a little joke. Because, you know, it's just like Five Guys, you know. It's too easy to play off of it. You know. Oh, what, what you gonna do? Um, this place has been around for like years. I mean, it's been around since the 80s. Trust me, you know, I you know, I just wish back then I would have knew about this place, you know. It you know, I, I didn't see no advertisements for it or nothing. You know, at that time the only thing I was looking at, you know, I kept seeing mad advertisements for Crazy John's. And don't get me wrong, for the time Crazy John's was the joint. Literally. It was it was the joint. But, you know, for for the time. That was when I didn't realize what good food was. You know, it, you know. The thing is, when you're a kid, you know, don't remember. Like, you know, only to a slight degree what good food is. You know, unless you're like really, unless it's really put out there in front of your face. You know, someone points it out, literally. But you know, your comprehension level hasn't totally cooked, kicked in, and you know, in full mode yet. You know, like for me. It didn't, you know, I didn't become aware of it to it probably maybe into my, like, I don't know. I'll say somewhere, somewhere in the middle of my teens. It's probably by the time I started realizing, you know, the deal with food. Or, you know, what or what was really, or what is considered to be good, good food. But, you know, the place I'm talking about, Cheeseburger Cheese, what makes it so awesome is, you know, when you do your order, all the toppings, I mean, I think probably for the exception, if you want, like, extra cheese or something, you gotta pay extra something for that, but, you know, for what it's worth, you know, pretty awesome deal, you know, you got your, you know, your fringe, your potatoes, you know, all, all, all that good stuff, you know, your different sauces, you know, they even got wraps now, you know, when I was going to Cheeseburger Cheeseburger before, they didn't even have wraps. This is like a new accommodation. I think to McDonald's did that first, though. To well, put an Angus burger in a wrap, so most I, places like to keep up with the others. Of course, I. But you know, I don't know who did it first, because I, mean, I think, I think it might have been pretty much like one of them. Yeah, one second, I'm gonna get an iced tea. I know this I, is the I, ghetto I, plaza, but yeah, we're in the ghetto plaza. I just want to get ice tea. I don't like it. I just Tea, she man. wants to get the ice cream. She's thirsty. Get ice but tea go, at Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah, yeah, you can get ice cream at Dunkin' Donuts. We're going back to what I was saying before. You know, um, it, you know, I think basically the whole thing with the rap thing is, in my opinion, I think is when I think it was at the time when you know Taco Bell was just doing so good with the raps. I think that was the answer to Taco Bell. People said, well, you know, we, you know, we got something for the for our competition. We got raps too. And look at this, she got her daggone foot tied to the daggone thing. Don't know what's going on. See, I tell you, you know, terrible. Oh, I tell you, I, don't, I just don't know sometimes. Anyway, getting back to what I was trying to say before, you know, like I said, this place is awesome. Anyone that is anyone, if you like hamburgers, go to Cheeseburger Cheeseburger. I mean, if you want to, if you, like I said, recommending places to go eat you know the cheeseburger cheeseburger there's a place in Haver, you guys i don't know what the hell the name of it is they, they do good burgers too i mean don't get me wrong i went to five guys okay their burgers are okay but the thing is cheeseburger cheeseburger as far as i know they make the best burger as far as i know you know it's good you know it's good food you know they have a, a large menu and see the thing about it, if you're the type of individual that you don't want to deal with fast food, this is definitely the place you should go. Definitely. You know, as you know, the thing is, it's also a good family environment. If you got kids, 
you know, if you got your ex-wife, you got, you know, other strange family members, or whatever the case may be, you know, take them down there, you know, put some food in their stomach, you know, shut them up, and, you know, and you can be on your way. It, it just works, people. It just works. You know, I like, you know, I like to, to go to places like that. And also, there's the whole attire factor. You know, you got this whole, you know, this old school diner look. You know, with the old icons on them. You got, you know, Elvis and all these, you know, all the other, all, all you know, little Richard, you know, all these other little, you know, the old Pepsi local, uh, I mean, icons and stuff. It's just a cool place. And you got the old music playing, you know. You know, songs like, you know, from the Beatles and, you know, uh, uh, let me see, like Beatles, maybe old Rolling Stones, that type of thing, you know. It's pretty much an awesome type of thing. You know, and, that, and I definitely say, you know, try it. Try it once. If you don't like it, you never have to go again. And uh, this is a Q Doma. Speaking out, and I'll uh, see you later. Bye-bye.